surprise one night that I will never forget. Um, we were at Beachfront in Huntington Beach, where we mostly were all of the time. And she introduced me to this guy, Colin. And later in the night, she comes up to me and she goes, so what do you think of Colin? Seems nice. Like, but to be perfectly honest, I didn't really realize what was happening in that moment because we didn't talk about stuff like that very much. So I didn't notice that that was really pivotal. The fact that my sister was asking me about a guy that she liked 10 years later, here we are. And we have been through a lot together. We have done wonderful things. We've bought houses, we've started companies. Um, we've lost a lot of people that we've loved, which has been rough. Um, but I do have to say that Daddy would be so proud of you. And he would be overjoyed to have you as an official second son. I met Colin a few years ago, and I'm not sure if you've ever met somebody that you just click with. We, we clicked, we had the same vision, we have all these things that we had in common. And as I got to know him, he told me about his girlfriend. And I had never met her, didn't see her. I ended up in Pleasanton when he hired me at his company. And I met Layla and I thought, this is beautiful. They had the best vibe that I've ever seen. The two of them have embraced me as family, as best friends, as confidants, as keen, as you will hear it <laughs> many a times. Um, but I could not have picked better friends, better sisters, better brother than the two of you. Colin, the day we met, I knew right away that I wanted to be your friend. Not just because you were so good looking, a Greek god, as you like to describe yourself, but because <laughs> once we started talking, we didn't stop. I just enjoyed your company so much, and at the time, I just hoped to be able to talk with you like that again. But I had no idea then that you would become my best friend forever. You've been my personal trainer, my golf coach, my karaoke manager, and my biggest fan. You have pushed me to do better and be better. You never give up on me. And because of that, I have been able to do things I never thought I could do. And I have become a better person for it. So Colin, today I take you to be my best friend, my faithful partner, partner and my one true love. I promise to encourage you and inspire you and to love you truly through good times and bad. I will forever be there to laugh with you, to lift you up when you are down, and to love you unconditionally through all of our adventures in life too. And I promise to do my very best to not leave coffee cups all over the house. Thank you for being my partner in this life. I love you, my doodle. Layla, I pledge to remain your companion and friend. I promise to be with you always. I promise to be with you always and to love and cherish you no matter how far apart we may be. I will always show an interest in the things you do and your ideas. I will be with you in your heart and keep you safe in mine. When you are happy, I will be happy with you. When you are sad, I will make you smile. I will encourage you to continue growing as an individual as we work together towards our mutual goals. I will always stand with you as your friend and husband and acknowledge that your choices are valid, valid ones. <laughs> I promise to give you Love, honesty, trust, and commitment. And I promise to keep our lives interesting and adventurous as we grow old together. Now, kiss the ride. All right. 
Mr. Colin and Mrs. Layla Weiner. 